A very, very good morning to you. It's Friday, the 17th of March. We're excited. Um, as you can see, we've chopped up wood. We're not excited because we've chopped up wood. There's like a little woods here and a load of fallen trees there. So we, I, we took advantage, well, I took advantage. In the rain last night, I got in there and uh, got hold of some wood. Um, so we're going to be warm, but we're excited because we're turning on to the Macclesfield Canal today. All systems go on chugs. Can't wait. Don't this chap. Sorry, I do a YouTube channel. And this chap's got exactly the same top on as little Noah. Can you see that? No, it's not Noah. It's not Noah, yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> Cheers guys, have a nice day. What's the name of your channel? If you search for Chuggerbug or Gary Captain Phillips. Have a nice day. You too, have a good one. Take care. That's nice. They're just having a, a towpath chat with their friends down here. But yeah, we're, we're excited to get on the Mac. New waters for the two of us. And that's good. Uh, we've got probably a good few months now of new waters. We haven't had breakfast yet. Uh, the kiddies are having their breakfast in the boat now, pancakes. And then uh, we're going in. But I have got a rather large piece of wood on the roof here. I want to cut that before we go. You can see it. But uh, I want to cut that before we go, get prepared. And then we're on, a, we're on our way. One lock stands between us and the Macclesfield Canal. You may notice that the water here is like orange juice or Lucozade. <laughs> It's due to the iron oxide spars that are near Harecastle Tunnel and the nearer you get to the tunnel, the more orange the water is. Uh, yeah, brought on by local mining in the area, but it's quite weird to see. But you'll notice that inside the locks, uh, it's all orange. It does taint everything. So I would have thought if you were to moor near here, it would stain your hull a little bit. I don't know, but I can't see it. If it does any harm, I've no idea. But it is, it's a weird colour. You can see the orange on the side of the lock here. Yeah, it's very weird. Last lock on the Trenton Mersey. That's it, new waters for us and chugs. We've been planning this for a few months. Ages. Ages. <laughs> we didn't ever think we were going to get on here. No. I've let go of the tiller. Not a good idea on a right hand bend. But yeah, we're on new waters. We're on the Macclesfield Canal. You know? <laughs> we are. <laughs> Love you. You okay? Yes, darling. Love you. Love you. <laughs> Getting a wave, hello! <laughs> I like your stack of wood! 
Yeah. Might not be there. That wood might be gone in the morning. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> if you recall the couple that are filmed this morning, that's their boat. That's where they are. He had the same top on as little Noah. Um, it, as I say, he didn't get it from the hippie boat. Uh, he got it from elsewhere. But yeah, lovely top. What lovely moorings these are here. And now we're just about to go over Pool Lock Aqueduct. Uh, we went under the aqueduct on the previous vlog, but we never noticed, to be honest. Our heads were busy, um, and we were just looking for more in, really, and getting through the last lock. But yeah, Pool Lane Aqueduct going over the Trenton Mersey. The Macclesfield Canal opened in 1831 and although uh, Thomas Telford was the main engineer, and Mr William Crossley was the main man responsible for the build. This feels like a breath of fresh air uh, to Nicky and I, it really does, not knowing what's around the next bend. It's lovely. So we're at a weird little stop lock. These stop locks, I'm sure you know because every vlogger tells you, including myself. Uh, they were put in to collect tolls uh, from different uh, canal companies. This would be the Trenton Mersey and the Macclesfield Canal Company. What beautiful little buildings. Look at this. Beautiful. I've got lots of little lock helpers on this one. And none of them know what they're doing. We do. They don't. Little Noah's in charge, I think. I've opened this lock gate for Gary. There's a lovely little footbridge here and Chugs is down there getting water. First water point on the Macclesfield Canal. We won't be here long. We don't need that much, but uh, that first lock was absolutely beautiful. Looking forward to this. And here you can see one of the milestones that go along the Macclesfield Canal here. The milestones were removed uh, before the First World War, sorry, the Second World War. I got a dirty look then off, Nicky. You never did. I got a dirty look, I did. 
did. It got a really dirty look. It was the Second World War. They were removed so as a precaution for enemy subs. Of course, you don't want submarines spotting where they, you know, where they're going. You don't want them knowing where to go. So they were removed and reinstated the Macclesfield Canal in the 80s. How did I do there, uh, editor? Fantastic. But did submarines come this far? I think they went down the Trenton Mersey. Yeah. I've got to say, this canal so far is breathtaking. Uh, Nikki's here, we're sat on the back, she's hiding. There. But we've just said, it's like being on holiday. Um, it's just breathtaking. It's beautiful scenery. Reminds us both a little bit of the Fangothlin, as we've seen some, some hills. We've got some hills over to the uh, starboard side here. Um, but it, yeah very nice and the bridges are just gorgeous Funnily enough, Nikki and I were just talking. And all the way from Wheelock to Bridge 82 on the Mac so far, how many boats have we seen? Two boats moving. Actually, obviously we've gone past loads of blimmin' boats. We're on a canal. But only two moving. It's just so quiet. It's nice, isn't it? It's lovely. They all know we're coming That's and they've, they've seen me driving. What an absolutely beautiful place this is. Um, we've just stopped for dinner, that's all. We're just preparing a bit of dinner and then gonna carry on. Um, we may check uh, the forecast, even though <laughs> the forecast and the, the apps are rubbish. Um, it's supposed to be raining all day today. Beautiful. Um, but this would be a lovely place to stop for a couple of days. So uh, I don't know what we're doing. I've just tied up on the center line. We're gonna get some dinner and just chill. What a life.
On our way again, been fed and watered. I've had ravioli and life on the edge here has had a pot noodle. <laughs> what did the kids have? Beans and sausages. There we go. Jinx! Yeah, can't, she can't talk now until I say her name. <laughs> Unlucky, Nikki. Thank you.